Liliana Diaz. I'm the support specialist genius here at scoring.com. And today I'll be discussing the primary contact information. So the use of the primary contact information. So in order to get to it, we're going to go over to configurations by going to our profile pictures, down to configurations. And then we're going to go to company portal profile. We're going to scroll down a little bit and we'll find the primary contact information. So in the primary contact information, we have the contact name, the contact number, a primary email, and the cellular number. The cellular number is optional. So anything that is marked in a red asterisk means that is, um, that is required by the system. So if you want to edit this information, just click on edit, scroll, and then you can add your last name if you want to. All right, now you can change your email or you can change your contact number. Once you're done, just click on save to save the information you changed. So the use of the primary contact information is for the template variables. So for example, if you have a template and you use the um, CRO name or the CRO primary contact name or the CRO email, this will be the information that will be populated onto that onto that template. So if you use your, um, your CRO contact number, it's going to be the one displayed in this area. This information will also be used, for example, the email will be used um, when sending the notice of account update. The copy will be sent to the email that is on the primary email section. So you want to make sure that if you want to receive the notice of account updates for your customer, to be sure to enter the primary email that you want those um, notice of account updates to go to. If you have questions regarding primary contact information or anything at all, please make sure to open up a chat and let us know. We're available Monday through Friday from 10 a.m. Eastern to 7 p.m. Eastern. And if we're not available at the moment, you can always leave the message. We'll tend to you as soon as possible. Thank you for your time and hope to see you in the next one.